don't buy the Samco Sport turbo inlet pipe for the B6A4. It's too short. This runner is too short to hook up to the turbo. In between the whole works, the way everything's going to be torqued around because of uh, fitment. Uh, and for some reason, maybe the size isn't exactly the way it's supposed to be. But uh, it just doesn't seal. This kept popping off the front of the turbo. Kept backing off. And I'd tighten it back on and it would back off. Um, I know it's only supposed to be under vacuum. The forge turbo inlet pipe for the B6A4 sticks out way out here, like where my finger is. It sticks way out. It's like two-thirds longer than this one. Uh, so it's like this four times. It's like way out here. So that's a, a tip that I'm passing along to the world. Um, other than that, I can't fault the uh, Samco. Other than it's a little softer, I think, maybe. It's a little softer than the Forge is. Um, I think this one is more expensive as well. But the Forge uh, is in the car now. And it, of course, it slid all the way onto the front of the turbo uh, with a lot of room. Um, whereas you can see this is kind of a thing of limitation. Uh, it's very short. And the way the body of it is built up like this, it's hard to get a band clamp on and stay on properly. So it's a little bit bulbous around this area, which does not help fit it on to the turbo. Uh, it looks to me like Forge left a lot more room on this part that goes to the turbo. So uh, they might have encountered the issue or solved that issue or had a history with that issue or just thought about it ahead of time. So I like that one. The Forge, it's on the car now. I don't plan to change it. It took me all day to fit it on the car. Let's see, it says Forge. Um, we're gonna give her a test and I'll uh, of course update whether it sucks or not. So far so good. <laughs> 